Hi, my name is Patty Dubroff, and I did makeup for Charlize's Queen Ravenna character for the Huntsman Winter War. Today, I'm going to show you how to do one of her many looks. Some of the things about the Queen's looks were that there was always an element of gold somewhere because she is the Golden Queen. And as she got more and more evil, her eyes got more and more dark and intense. So the eye that I'm gonna do is one of the intense dark smoky eyes with a gold pop in the center. So I'm using a dark brown pencil and I'm going to draw it along the lash line, elongate the, the eye. And then I'm also gonna use this pencil to draw the crease shape. Some pencils are waterproof they're really hard to blend. This one is not waterproof, so it gives me the ability to blend it and smudge it, and I'm creating the, the contoured shape of what I want the eye to look like. I'm winging it out. I want it to be have some drama. One of the things about the queen's look is that because it was this, like the bird, you know, the raven quality, I made the, um, the crease quite intense on the bridge of the nose because it kind of gave this real spookiness. So that's all just the pencil. I like to have a concealer brush around to clean up in case the shape is not exactly where I want to leave it. I'm also going under the eye to give intensity, depth, I'm also putting the pencil on the uh, inner corner and the outer corner more intensely. That was the pencil that was blended into the shape. So now to set it, I'm going to use some eyeshadow, matte eyeshadow. I'm kind of going between a matte brown and a black. And I'll set where I want the pencil to stay put which is primarily the crease. I'm not using heavy amounts of eyeshadow. I'm really just using the eyeshadow as a way to help the pencil stay put. And I'm not using anything with a frost uh, in the dark tones because I want there to be the gold is the only thing that's going to have any kind of luminosity and shine. So it really pops off the lid. This is also more shadow intensifying the lower lash line. Now I'm going to take a black pencil, and I'm gonna further intensify the inner rim. This is for really deep and smoky, and the corners. And again, if your skin is a very dark tone, you can kind of just start off with black. And if your skin is very fair, um, if you want to bypass black and use a dark brown or a dark gray, that would work as well. So the next step is the pop of gold, because obviously the queen, she's the golden queen, she always has gold somewhere. So for this look, the gold is really centered on the lid. So in the space where it was left open from the, um, from the dark tones, there's a pop of gold. And this is a gold cream. So on the film, it was always fun to find a place to incorporate gold and make it look really beautiful, like a piece of kind of jewelry for the face. And gold is super wearable for everybody. Um, you know, but if you want to use silver, that's an option too. This look would look great with the black eye with a pop of silver instead. So that's the gold cream. And I'm gonna set that with a bit of gold powder. And it's keeping it really focused on the lid. I'll go back and just make sure that the crease is very dark so the gold really pops out of there. Now to frame the eye, I'm gonna use a generous amount of mascara. So some of the distinctive qualities of Queen Ravenna is gold. And her sister Freya was the ice queen, so she was silver. So there was a lot of interplay in the costumes, in the sets, and in makeup um, between gold and silver. Smoky eyes can be less, made less complicated by removing too many eyeshadow steps. 
So by blending out the pencil and then putting one layer of shadow on top of it to hold it, you, you actually can kind of save a lot of time instead of relying on eyeshadow to try to get the depth of the eye. So one last little touch that, depending on how much you want to play up the gold, this was something I kind of snuck in, was a little bit of gold brushed into the eyebrows. And that's something that's actually kind of a great look if you're doing a natural face and you just want to do like a little ornamentation without it being too intense. A little kind of brush of, this is a gold cream, brushed into a spoolie brush. It's a really nice touch. And this is Evil Spooky Queen Ravenna's Golden Smoky Eye.